<laughs> it's probably too late to save them. The only spot left with no jealous spikle junipers is right in the middle. <gasps> oh! And that's exactly what they need to do! Meet in the middle! Hip, hip, hooray! Raise up, clock! <laughs> go, Beastly! Go, Beastly! Come on, you did it! You figured it out! Oh, give me some love, Beasters! Come on, bring it in! Bring it hey. in! Hands off the merchandise! What do you think this is, a petting zoo? Gross! <laughs> Cher, please stop. These bushes are jealous spikled junipers, and they are being created by you. Us? Uh, yes, with a double S S. You. You're both jealous of each other and your new friendships. Please, that's ridiculous. I am not jealous, even though you seem way happier without me as your BFF. But you know, what else? Pshaw, me either. I'm totally fine. Although you seem perfectly delighted now that I'm not your BFF. Whoa, 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 whoa. Well, uh, bears, something is causing these junipers to grow. Are you sure you're not feeling a little eensy, beensy, weensy bit jealous? Well, I guess it did make me feel bad when Cher took Cozy to our special picnic place. I kind of didn't want her to be happy, which made me feel even worse. And I was afraid that Harmony would become better friends with Lottie than with me. That made me feel afraid that I was losing my friend. Jealousy makes you feel that way. That's why these bushes grew and pushed you two bears apart. But you can fix things by, by getting back together. Oh, come on, Cher. Are we going to let a few jealous spikled junipers get in the way of our friendship? Oh, ah! Smarts! Oh, no, Harmony. I'm sorry I let jealousy come between us. You know that I'll always be your BFF. Ah, me too, Cher. And I'm sorry I didn't tell you I was inviting Lottie today. It doesn't mean that I don't love our special time together, too. This is great! You guys, the jealous Michael Junipers need jealousy to grow. But when you feel less jealous, they go away. Keep going. Go, 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 go. Well, I'm... Actually glad now that we found new friends. And knowing we will always have our special memories too makes me feel less jealous. Yeah, having Lottie and Cozy here with us just makes it more fun. We can all eat and play music. Oh, I missed you, Harmony. I missed you too, Cher. The Cher Cloud is nowhere in sight. Just care hearts. Care hearts, care hearts. How do we find the share cloud when the share cloud is weak and all these lost care hearts are blocking our view, huh? Yes, it is a bit of a brain teaser. The only way to find Wonder Heart is to find the share cloud, and the only way to find the share cloud is to find Wonder Heart. <laughs> hey, bright idea alert. What if we collected all these care hearts? Us? Collect care hearts? Yes. These care hearts are lost and their instinct is to pull towards the share cloud. If we can wrangle enough care hearts and harness their strength, they should lead us straight to the share cloud and to Wonder Heart. Oh, Brighto, I think that is the best idea you've ever had. Sorry! Care crew, grab your gear. All right, team. We need to get as many Care Hearts on board as possible. Wonder Heart and the Share Cloud are counting on us.
No wonders, the cousins fixed everything. They collected the care hearts, they got them into the share cloud. Wait, what? The cousins, the care hearts, the share cloud? Yes, Wonder Heart, but more importantly, how are you feeling? I, I feel like I failed. Failed? Why, Wonder Heart? Because I'm the one with the special belly badge power. The care hearts and the share cloud are my responsibility. And you had to fix it all. I couldn't do it. Actually, I've been doing some calculations, Wonder Heart, and it is not mathematically possible for anyone to collect all the care hearts by themselves, even if she does happen to have a super spectacular belly badge power. See, folks you love don't always know how to ask for help. So instead of feeling sorry for ourselves, we should have been there for you when you needed it. So much to do, so much to do. Gotta make all my bumbleberry biscuits now so the oven's free for when Cheer comes with her fruits and veggies later. Oh! Isn't that last batch of biscuits done yet? Almost time. Better wait here. Don't want them to burn. Oh, but those forks and spoons and plates and cups for the share shack need to be set outside. I can't wait a second. Better wait. Oh, it'll be fine. I'll be back in two flicks of a bear's tail. Storks just the funniest. Why, this one time I remember some storks now were chatting it up, and wouldn't you know, one of them just turned to me and said, Biscuits! Team Heal Grumpy? Aren't you supposed to be with Grumpy? That's uh kind of the point of the team. Sorry, Lottie, but he kicked us out. As soon as he found out Team Heal Grumpy included you, he didn't want us around either. At least till his ankle's all better. Maybe it's for the best. He just needs a little time to himself. Soon, he'll be all better, and things can go back to just how they were, with Grumpy just being Grumpy. But I made this healing jelly. Who's gonna put it on him now? Maybe he can get better without it. Oh, maybe you're right. I felt so bad about him getting hurt in the first place, I just want to be a part of making him better. But maybe he could just get better on his own. As long as he gets better, it doesn't really matter how he gets better. Oh, no! Look! Grumpy's back on top of his caravan. Team Heal Grumpy, let's roll! That rat forgot the paintbrush. Uh-oh. Oh, no! Uh, oh, okay, I'm stuck. Hang on, Grumpy. We're coming to help! Okay. I hate to admit it, but I could use the help. Harmony and Cheer, hold the ladder steady. Come on down, Grumpster! Ooh! Woo! I made it. Good thing Lotsa wasn't here. This totally would have gotten messed up. Grumpy, I'm not sure Lotsa being here or not being here had anything to do with anything. Yeah, well, it's my ankle, and I'm not taking any chances. Yoo-hoo! Here I come! Big bowl of ankle-fixing healing jelly on the way! Oh, no! <laughs> <laughs> Grumpy, you're back. Uh oh. Grumpy. Whoa. Grumpy, stop. This is simply illogical. You've got to start trusting Lotsa again. But I did trust Lotsa, and it landed me in this chair. And if you trust me again, we can get you out. Oh, yeah? Sounds great, but. How can I know that for sure? I guess you can't know for sure. I mean, not for absolute total sure. But I want to help you. And I wish you wouldn't keep doubting me and you'd let me try. 
Maybe this jelly won't work. But maybe it will. We won't know for sure till we try. Let's give it a try, Grumpy. It can't hurt, right? Sure it could hurt, but maybe it won't. Ooh, ooh, it hurts my nose already. That stuff stinks. You know what, Latza? Maybe you should just forget about all this. <laughs> Thanks for protecting me, Brino. I'm not protecting you. I'm protecting Latza. Oh. Wow. <laughs> I guess I have been pretty hard on you, huh, Latza? And it's true, you've only been trying to help. It's, it's just hard to trust again sometimes after things go wrong. Even if it was just an accident, but... I can try. Maybe. I guess. No! Wonderheart! Stop! Huh? Hi, Uncle Tenderheart. Happy Care Cleaning Day! Oh, oh yes. Uh, thank you. I helped you clean by getting rid of all this 